Okay, back again with another uh, tune here. This one is, of course, got the caption posted up there. This one, of course, is uh, based on Star Trek. I, I, you know, everybody has themes. Uh, Star Trek is a, is a good theme for space. It's a nice commonality. We all know the characters. I prefer, if I do a Star Trek thing, to go with the original. Uh, just because I can't stand the other ones. Uh, <clears throat> so, anyway, we're going to pop into this cartoon here. I'll give my the thing a chance to focus. If it will focus, it's coming down great. Let's get started here. Okay, so this one, obviously, Captain Kirk or his his likeness, his namesake, whoever. It doesn't necessarily have to be Captain Kirk. He could be a Star Trek character with Kirk-esque qualities. Uh, and he's been beamed down onto a a uh, a planet, and you can see he's got some he's 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 run into some issues is what's happened here. So uh, I'm gonna just kind of get 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 it started here. I got his feet positioned, and I, I'm going to move. <clears throat> that was the foreground. I put in the feet just so I could put in the tongue of this great beast or something that he's he's uh, he's uh, on. And I'm going to have the so his the beast tongue is going to be. I was kind of loose with the uh, with the background because it's it's not a complex background. I'm I'm gonna try to make the the tongue a little give it a little more texture. Um, you know, like it's it's an organic thing with, and I won't I probably won't color in the um, the the dots. I'll kind of leave those white or whatever color just to uh just because i i want the i'm going to kind of shade with dots here on this part and so this um it's supposed to look like a tongue hopefully hopefully i'm i'm doing an okay job of making it look like an organic thing I want to get carried away. I don't want to spend a lot of time on this. Okay, so that's the tongue. Um, so I'm going to put some molars. I think I'll just start right here. I mean, what does a super huge molar look like? I, I you know, you you be the judge there, and then and then you got to decide: Do I want to show gum line? But I'll I'll just I'll I'll give it some molar. Ah, probably a little more rounded there. I gotta, you know, like it's like it's been. So I, I'll be able to uh, show with some coloring, um, you know, um, uh, more of the uh, contrast with the. So that's. That's the molar there. I'll probably show this. Okay, so that's one side of the molars. Uh, I'm gonna do the other side, and it's gonna it's gonna kind of be a fairly striking cartoon. Uh, the way I have him framed here. You know what? I think I think uh, I'll just eyeball it. I, I I was gonna try to match it up as. As best I can, you know. Some it's 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 a mouth, so you're gonna want to be fairly symmetrical. So this was the first molar, and that will probably be bled off the page. And that's molar number one. Molar number two is here, and I'll get that one like so. And that's molar number two, and then molar number three. Um, right about here. And I'm 
getting quiet. If I always get quiet if I'm not sure. Okay, so that's the mouth. Now what I'm going to do, I'm I'm going to mod. I'm going to put. I think I'm going to finish him up right now. Now that I got the the uh, him more or less drawn, uh, the 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 thing drawn. I uh, you can see in the cartoon I drew his, his hand a little, his arm a little long, but and that's that's where I can I can self edit. I can self-edit. Relax, relax, citizens. I I can. I can edit this. Okay, so there's his hand. I'm gonna put his hand in. Ah, oh, make it a little lower, a little lower. Come on, relax. I'm gonna get there. There's his hand. That's that's the bottom half. Okay, I'm gonna move this back up. I kind of like his 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 face is simple, but he's got like a a pretty worried look there. I like that. I'm gonna give him the communicator. So I I think you know it's weird when the when the first uh, the first Star Trek uh, happened. You thought oh it would be great to have a communicator with that and now. Now look what we got. It's 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 crazy. So this this is the captain. Give him some good hair. And I just, I'm gonna give him that. They have like a, a a dark collar, and that's a pretty good little Captain Kirk there. I'm gonna put a a phaser in his hand there. He's gonna have a phaser. There he is, nice, nice phaser there. I, I think I got a good hand going on there, a good cartoony hand, and he's got, and the phaser. The phasers are a little odd. They, they are, they go back a lot further than, than uh, ours would. And let's see, it's got some sort of a. A cone gizmo coming out of it. I'll I'll do my best here. It doesn't have to be true to form. There's his face. That's a good looking phaser. I like that phaser. Yeah, that's a good good looking phaser. Nice job. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to make a I'm going to make an on the fly edit, but I'm going to do it with with the assistance of a pencil. Just to give myself, since I'm going to go pen, what I'm going to do is I, I put the, the, uh, I kind of frame it where I'm just going to frame it more or less. I'll put it right even with this this corner here, so I have a frame of reference of where I'm going to actually end up with it. So, so there it is. It's like this. And now what I'm going to do is I want the, I kind of want the the whole of Captain Kirk to be framed here. And so I'm going to make the maw. This is the maw. And then I'll make the uh, the dangly hopper. I think it's a, a uvula. I'm not, don't even, don't even ask me for sure. And I'll, I'll kind of, I'll kind of make it pretty dark. I'll make like a, I'll, I'll put a, 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 a line there like a pretty dark line and I won't even make it I'll make it kind of organic and then I'm gonna I think I'll just do it do a two stager I'll I don't I might not even do the line maybe I'll do it with just coloring I'll just use this as the this uvula thing as as the background and then and then it's gonna be maw uh, just like that and I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put in the upper teeth they're just gonna I'm just gonna have to figure that out. So, um, okay. So let me put it back here, marry it up, and there's about where I want my my pen line to be. And I'll just go for it. And I want to I want to kind of miss the the tip of the gun. Uh, no, I'll just totally bisect the the gun. How about that? No, I'll miss it. I'll miss it. I don't want the 
the thing to be quite perfect. It's 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 an organic uh, thing. So this is like so, and 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 so like I said, the I'm gonna make some lines here, but I think I'm gonna I'm going to um, I don't want them to be perfect lines. I want them to be. And the, so so what'll happen here is is in, in the computer all kind of started off fairly dark and then get pretty much to black by the time it gets down here so I don't really want to have so that's that's pretty much it let me I'll do some some lines here to not just to to give it some shape but I don't, I don't really want, I'm not going to mess with the top teeth. We, we know what I'm, what I, what I'm intending is that, is that, so I just want to make it look sort of organic on top. We throw in some bumps and whatever, just to give it a more of a natural kind of look. Okay. So that's, that's the cartoon. I like this. I like the way it came out. Okay, so that's that's more or less it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and sign it. One that I drew this a while ago, I believe. And this is one of those ones where I have mystery not dated it. Um, I'm going to give it an approximation. So I'm going to call it uh, a couple of years ago. Um, but I'm pretty sure, given where it is in the stack, that that's pretty much it. Okay, so we'll take a quick look at that uh, when it's colored here in just a little bit. And bam, there it is, the finished tune. Uh, it came out pretty nicely. If there's a lot of pink in there. I didn't see any way around that, but that's the way mouths are. Um, I I like the way his uh, Captain Kirk's expression is. It, that's one of the the difficult things to do when you're doing cartoons. Uh, the fewer lines that you use, the more difficult sometimes it is to convey an expression. Uh, in this case, he's got an expression of kind of concern, like, what what have they done to me here? And uh, I, I think it came out pretty well. Uh, so, uh, let me give myself a B on this one. And, um, yeah, thanks for joining me. I'll, I'll catch you in the next tune.